hi guys welcome back to my channel if you are new here you are welcome thank you so much all my returning subscribers so today i'm going to be making this particular canoe is known by the northerners and is made from millet so in this bucket here i have some cloves some ginger so i soaked these overnight and i'm going to be grinding it keep watching so you can get the full video and it's actually a very healthy drink okay guys so like i said this is what i blended here um this is um the millet and i told you that it has ginger and cloves so i'm going to be using a cloth to sieve it right now so this you have you want to have a cloth like this to sieve your millet So you put your plate over a bowl like this. You don't have to tie it because you're going to be lifting it. So you want to add water to this one so that it can easily come out. More water. Guys, don't mind this dog. It's every time that I'm videoing that they come to talk, that they back. I really don't understand. So you pour it like this. You don't want to pour everything. You want to do this process little by little. So you hold it like this. You hold it like this. You want to make sure everything is out. And you shake it like this. Shake it like this. So while I'm, while I'm cooking this cologne, like I've told you guys before that canoe is something that is known in the north very well and is made from a grain called millet. The northern people call it gero. It's a very very healthy meal. So as I'm when I'm going to cook it, I'm going to be telling you guys the health benefit. So make sure you watch this video to the end. So you do the same process. So everything is saved okay guys so this is how your sieved cone should look like and the next thing to do is to cook it i'll soon show you the process while we're doing that let me show you something special guys so this is our curry powder original authentic curry powder like this curry powder has over 15 ingredients it will give you that natural color you're looking for we took the best ingredient like selected them make sure they are very clean and we produce this it's good for your fried rice boiling meat and if you purchase this when you see fun fact about curry how to use and the health benefits so don't sleep on this please buy okay guys also our thyme leaf is here original thyme leaf like this is the thyme leaf that is freshly um processed and this package and very good for you it also has health benefits and how to use so enter into my dm and purchase and the last but not the least guys this is a particular spice that everybody is talking about like everyone that has used it is like i want that mixed spice that thing that when you put inside your food all your neighbors are wondering what's happening like they don't they can't just come to your house and knock but the aroma is fantastic so don't sleep on this purchase and use and this has over 20 ingredients like selected ingredients healthy and good so please dm me for prices thank you so in your boiling water you want to add half of your sieved kuno you add half this should be half and you want to stir this and I like to cook. You stir this and I love to cook. So when it's cooked, you add this. So let's don't I don't think you should cover it because it can boil over. So just I like to boil by itself, then you add the rest. So guys, I want you to take note of something. Can you see the one in the pot? Can you see the color is darker and the one that is not cooked is brighter? So this was this cooked for like five minutes. So the next thing you are going to do is to pour the one that is not cooked into the one that is cooked i'm sure you can see can you see 
This is a particular taste you have when you don't cook all the kuno at once. Some people cook everything at once, but if you want to have both um, cooked and a little bit raw taste, you can do it like this. So, this one too, you say I like to cook, but not for long. I like this cook for two minutes. And I want to actually add my sugar while it's on fire so that it can easily melt. So guys, this is how your kono should look like. Guys, I'm sure you love this goodness. Can you see the, the way it looks? It's going to taste so yummy. So like I said, I was going to taste it while it's hot. Children, please and please don't try this at home. Because even me, I'm going to be very careful because it's something I have done before. So I'll just be putting some inside this mug. And I'm going to be blowing it as I'm trying to sip it just to be sure that the sugar is enough. So help me God. Mm. it's beautiful very very beautiful okay guys thank you so much for staying to the very end see you on my next video bye